Okay, now I'm going to show you how to attach the clay to the bat. What we want to do is kind of get it as centered up as we can to begin with. Kind of look at it and just kind of see it. You know, you don't want to fight it, so there's no point in sticking it over here. So you want to get it in a good spot and kind of feel around. Okay, that looks good. So now we're just going to take our hands like this, lift it, bam. Give it a good hard push because you want it stuck on there. Now I'm going to let the wheel spin. I'm going to wet down my hands. I'm going to take my elbow and I'm going to put it into my gut here. Now this, this is going to be the support that's going to center the pot is between here and here. And I'm going to push with this hand down onto the clay to make sure it's secured on the bat before I start centering. Okay, now I've pushed the clay onto the bat. The process of centering is taking the clay from underneath and squeezing it in your hands and, and bringing it up and then pushing it back down, and we're going to do that now. See how it's pushing up, square off the top, and then using this part of my hand, I'm going to push it back down, and with this part of my hand, I'm going to keep, you, I'm going to keep it in, in position. So here we go. You're going to want to do this several times just to get the entire lump of clay centered on the wheel. It's not just the outside, it's the entire lump. So you're not just skimming, you're not just skimming the outside of this, you're actually squeezing the entire lump up through your hands. Now we can see that's fairly good and centered. A little touch up, just kind of get your wrist, your, your arm in there, lock it in. Just touch it like that. And there we go, you see how it's all lined up. And you just run your finger along there and you can see. It's not going like this, it's nice and smooth. Now I'm gonna take my rib tool with the edge on it. And I'm just gonna take off the little last ragged edge of the bottom of the pot. This will help with trimming and it'll also help when I'm pulling up the walls of the pot. So now I'm going to, I'm going to enter the pot and open it. Um, and we're going to do that next.